Lorenzo J. Reina back at it with Lee Central Coast News. The sun is starting to come up and not only that, Alan Hancock has showed up and with me is Mr. Ben Wilcom entering his second yeah. year at Alan Hancock. Well, what's going through your head as the season is already on the horizon? You know, we're just uh, working hard on the field right now, waiting for our first game, you know, getting to fill each other out on uh, the defensive side. And, you know, just building up that chemistry leading into the first game. Would you say that the uh, Hancock defense is a lot younger, um, maybe has maybe has a bunch of new faces this upcoming year? Uh, yeah, uh, we have a lot of new DBs. Mm -hmm. uh, we have about seven uh, returners, Okay. but the rest are pretty much new. But, I mean, with all these, like, um, all these new faces, I mean, does the scheme change or does it stay the same? Uh, no, it stays the same, you know, just Bulldog football. Mm -hmm. And you want to talk about your role on this defense. I mean, are you, you one of those guys calling the shots, uh, maybe calling different coverages? Uh, as of right now, you know, no one's sure uh, what their role is yet. We haven't got there yet. Uh, everyone's just working hard, getting to fill each other out and waiting for a chance to figure out a role. I know like when you're a freshman playing at the JUCO level, it's an adjustment period. Um, do you feel like you've already made that adjustment that now you, you have more, you know more or less what to expect? Yeah, uh, I made that adjustment about last year at the end of the season, you know. I feel uh, very comfortable right now. Mm -hmm. And you want to talk about the relationship you have with Chris Dutra along with the other Hancock coaches and I mean just, has it improved, has it stayed the same or? Yeah, um, relationship-wise with all the coaches, definitely improved. You know, everyone's uh, really close. We're like a family. Mm -hmm. And you know, you're you're one of many uh, Oro Grundy guys on that field. So who else is out there as well? Uh, we have uh, Alex, Chucky, and that's the only two Oro Grundy oh, players. Just you two guys? Yeah. Yeah, but you know what? You guys play a pretty prominent role, you would say, on that field, right? Uh, yes, sir. Just working hard. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, where do things stand college-wise for you? Any any interest, any letters, scholarships? Uh, not at the moment. So nobody's sending you letters, nothing? No, I've, I haven't reached out to any coaches yet. I'm uh, okay. trying to figure out how this season's going to go, and then after that, we'll see. All right, so my last question. I mean, give us some of your individual goals, and then give us some of your team goals this upcoming year. Uh, to earn a starting spot, and then for my team goal is just uh, to win as many games as possible and get into a bowl game. All right. He's one of the local products representing Allen Hancock College from Aurora Grande. We're definitely going to keep a close eye on the Bulldogs this upcoming year. Lorenzo J. Reyna with Lee Central Coast News.